James, what areas or, of, or interpretations have you experienced? Like, yeah, grey areas. Um, uh, the biggest one that um, I uh, find uh, a challenge uh, uh, on a weekly basis is um, is this interpretation that you only need to account for noise when it's raised as an issue at, at the planning stage, um, uh, which is a, a, a real wrong interpretation um, of, um, uh, of of the regulation and and, the, and requirement 012A, um, really, uh, and. Um, yeah, it's a challenge because you you you're you're trying to explain to your clients that um, if they don't account for for noise at night, for example, they can't demonstrate that they're compliant with some of the sections of of um, proof document. O. Um, but it's often used because there the, there is an interpretation that um, uh, that because the, the 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 there's wording in in the in the document that says for example um if planning raised it is an issue um that's you taken as being gospel that's the only time you account for it being an issue um uh, which is just not the case not the case for for the acoustics industry's interpretation or or, or anyone else that could really read that in, in a real sense so that's one thing that i find is, is a struggle with those interpretations um um the other thing which uh the grey areas are um, interstitial blinds. Um, uh, are they inside? Are they outside? <laughs> what, uh, where do they sit? I don't know if other people on the call have had these um, uh, same challenges. Um, but yeah, uh, um, I get asked it semi-regularly. Um, uh, uh, you know, can we? Uh, why do we have to have external blind shutters? For example, can't, can we? Ha uh, I appreciate we can't have curtains or internal blinds, but can can we account for something that's inside the glazing? Uh, and it's uh, it's not it's not it's not clarified anywhere. So it's not it's a bit of an, a grey area really, which um, you have to ask. Oh, Susie's got a hand up. <laughs> we we have asked that question, and I my understanding is that DLUC have approved or HSC whoever they are now have approved for interstitial blinds and f internal shutters that are kind of built in that they yeah, can be okay. used within the calculations within the dynamic modeling method anyway oh. uh, but they have to be sort of installed and built in so that they're not removable well removable but not easily removable yeah, not, not as easily, simply yeah. as taking curtains down and putting something else up yeah um but yeah they they is it Okay. I can't remember if it went into the FAQs or not. I'm not sure it did, but I've definitely no. got an email somewhere saying it's allowed. So <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> so it I hasn't gone into the FAQs. 